Uh, praise the Lord, brethren. We thank God for this time and for this day. This is midweek service, and we thank God for all of you who are tuning in and ready to listen to the message the Lord has for each one of us uh, this evening. Let us pray as we begin our service. Lord God, our Heavenly Father, we thank you for being a good God, a God who creates, a God who takes care of what you create, a God who provides, a God who gave us a way out of what we do. Lord, we thank you for being such a God. We pray that, Lord, you continue to guide us in our thinking, in our talking, in our actions. May we see you at work in our lives. For this evening, Lord, we pray that you speak to each one of us. Make us the people you want us to be. Create us anew. We thank you for when we depend on you, you are a faithful God. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, we have prayed. Amen. Our brethren, I would like to greet you again and to thank God for enabling us to be here this evening. Uh, I would like to introduce a new uh, topic for this month. When we met as the clergy, we agreed that July should be a month to talk about families, family God in our families. And we thank God that July is here, and today is the first day uh, for that. So we are going to look at uh, family for the entire month even during Wednesday services and Sunday services. We'll be talking about issues in our families, and we have different speakers. For me, I'm just making an introduction of this uh, great topic that we are handling families. Tuagalo kweto nda, nti... Omutapta wa fe Mr. Wango tali wota sobe de kubera o na yemba denga ni nzamu na havali kumukutu guno guarero msavi seno no kubate geza nti omwezi guno guo msavu July e kani sanga ba uli tuate se te se tuogere kunsonga ya maka wanga fe na tuli mumaka tu vamu maka tu vera mumaka era tu wele zamu maka no recho tu ina ba geziwa njia ulo. Abagendo kugera kusonge no, umwezi kuno kuna, kuroksa tu, era ne kusande, ngao kusawa kwa fevu kuli tuwa ni zanyo, era tuwe waza nyonyi ni dala, ukuwe era wao. Every individual comes from a family, and we belong to families, and it was God's intention that He created us to be in families. I'm not going to talk much about God and family today, and that will be a topic for next Sunday. But I wanted just to say that you know what is happening in families today. The enemy knows that when he attacks the family, then he is in control of almost everything. Children, mothers, fathers, husbands, wives, maids, porters, whoever we come from families. And so when the enemy attacks a family, he gets to know that he has attacked the entire sector of our staying. Even us at work, even those who are, wherever you are, you are affected. So we pray that the Lord continues to guide us and to teach us what is expected of us as a family. So, oruari yu tugenda kuogela kusonge yu, na yinga tuweba za katonda. Nti atuwa debango kubena mumaka, atela no kuogela nafe. Nga ima mumaka, buli mtu jamu teka. Our topic for today is the theme, and our family is parenting a midst life Challenges, parenting amidst life challenges. O kulera abana, munchuka chuka no buziwe tuitamu, o buliwoka akati. 
kubange ndera feje twale rebwanganze eyazali bo miyaka jata ano ne kulira mujenkaga endera je batulera si endera je tuteko kulera abalero kubanga embera echuse abaganda bagamba nti enswa bwe chusa amaso nawo chuse mvubo no rwensonge tino kutunulira makamo tuli nga tuima mu mbera eriwo no recho ngera kuogera ku nsonge eno eyo kulera abana makaga fe na ye mu mbera ya kakati no kusomoze bwa kwetu itamu when we read psalm 127 i will read only three verses because of time but i would like you to go back and read the whole psalm it is a short psalm with only five verses i'm reading from verse 3 children are a gift from the lord they are a reward from him children born to a young man are like arrows in a warrior's hands how joyful is the man whose quiver is full of them he will not be put to shame when he confronts his accusers at the city gates ebigambo betugenda okogera ko kakano mkozi seza za buli ya 10 mwa 2 mwa msanvu enyiri esa twezi semba yo lokusa tunolo okunalo okutano ziga mantiraba abana bwe busika bwa mukama nebibala byo rubuto eyo yempera aye abana busika bwa mukama abana busika bwa mukama children are not a liability but they are a gift from god what you have some people who have had children they think well it's god who gives he does not has no hand in their children maybe someone was just raped and it resulted into a pregnancy and eventually a child maybe you did not intend it but somehow you got a child and you think god has no hand in that kind of baby but that's not true children are not a liability but they are a gift of god no matter how they come god gives us the opportunity to take care of these children the rewards the gifts to us as individuals to us as a family to us as a church to us as a nation no recho katonda bwatu abana abana busika bwa mukama nebibala byolubuto yempera ye abana busika bwa mukabi bibala ebiva jali so si bo maze gafuna ntero kuogera kino tirumuna ali nambula ne nsango omwana omu ne mubuze erinyali nanga matinze bya rusago ne mubuza aba bya rusago bedira kintu simanyi mama ye yali ntuma Nebwe natuka ku mama ne mubuza nti omwana ona ngambye nti ebya rusago ya rusago bedira chi mama we nangati musumba bye bye bya mwana oyo bizibu byali bya kusaga twali tusaga busazi no mulenzi ne mfuno omwana ke bava bamutuma bya rusago tata wabera wa tali jabera ani amulabirira nti nze mulabirira bato alo omwana oyo nge byo kusaga Nimbaga na yo mwana ye siji wa kusaga omwana katunda aba muwadde oba mmwe mwachi kola mu busiru siru bwa mmwe ne yo wakati wo busiru siru bwa mmwe katunda aba wadde omwana no lwecho mwino kumutwala nge kirabe ekiva eri katonda no kumulera temugeera kumuga amanti byali bya rusago ne katunda agenda kubabuza omwana gwe nabawa mu mulabiride mutya no lwecho there not a liability but they are gift they are a reward from the lord katonda bwa kwesigana ku wo mwana oyino kulabirira omwana oyo ngo mwana wa katonda so see ngo mwana gwo maze galonda mukuvai sule yabiri eyo kubiro nyoro mwenda lugama ntitwala omwana ono munyonseze nange ndi kuwemperayo tuyo saba nabano kulwo muntu omulala alitusasula ngabwe tukoze no lwecho 
Bwetuba nga tula bilida habana. Tetuba tuwala nga echi ntucho nekitagasa. Na inga katonda batu wade. I was saying Exodus chapter 2 verse 9 says, Take this child and nurse him for me and I will pay you. When you do your work so well, the Lord will reward you, will pay you. When you take a child and you neglect to take care of that child, still God pays you. He gives you a reward accordingly. So it is not your child. It's a child of God. You are just a custodian. You are just a steward. You are just taking care of the child, but he has the owner who happens to be God. Parenting. If I wanted to explain, what does it mean? Parenting is a process of promoting and supporting physical, emotional, social, and intellectual development of the child from infancy to adulthood stage. Parenting is a process. It's not a one-time thing. But he says it's a process of promoting and supporting. You promote and support the development of this child physically, socially, emotionally, and intellectually. The entire child. You have to see to it that when God gives you a child, all the aspects are catered for. Omwana bwabanga azali dwa mutunulire ngo ino kumuyigiriza ebigambo byonne bikwata ku bulamu bwe obulamu bwe ngo omwana ali abulunji asula walunji muyonjo alabirirwa bwalwa alajanja bibwa physical body atera mutwale ngo omwana ono mukuza mu bulamu bwa buli jengeri ya kolagana ne banno socially engeri ya kolagana na banne engeri ya kolagana ne bazaddebe Ingeri jali reti ngana haba kade, ingeri jali reti ngana haba tovane, ingeri jali ino kwe isa na haba somesa. Social life and intellectually. Labanti omwana akula ni mkubiroza ni magezi agabuli jo. So si kukula bukuzi kubanga alia na kuta ni yebaka. Ni yola banga na magezi agabuli jo, omwana oyo era na guwa agafuna. So omwana ino kukuzi buwa yena. Nga mukuru, omubiri, omuoyo, obuongo, nebidala. Nga alabida akuwesa katonda chitibwa, atenga namu abazade, mumwe ya galidamu. Norecho, abada bubisikabu wa mukama, baino kubala bidida, no kubala, no kubala igirizo bulonji. Buoto chikolo umwana na akuranga, akuze muwawa, wali ya wantubanji buosa, umwana akuze nga mujimunga wali ya bulonji, nenga magezi gumutwe taina. Tamanyi kubuza bantu, tamanyi kola gana na bantu, tamanyi chino, wabaa kuze muwawa. Elaba njizu kula ni wagamanti ya kula mtu wenga mare. Chovo sango msaji wa mkulu, obo mkazi wa mkulu, tamanyi kubuza, tamanyi kogela na wakulu, tamanyi kutege, tamanyi ye tambulida wacho. Alabi kaburu unji, fizikale, na ye, te ya kuzibwa mbuongo, okutege la wasani do kuisibwa. So we have to educate our children and make them the children who glorify our Lord God because the children belong to God. In Luke chapter 2, verse 39 to 40. Luke chapter 2, verse 39 to 40 talks about how Jesus grew. It is written in my Bible that Jesus grew up healthy and strong. That is the physical. He was filled with wisdom. He was filled with wisdom, emotionally and intellectually. He grew with God's favor on him. Yakula, mwana na akula, Bible yegaba, tulimuluke sule yokubidi. Olinyuru asa tumomuenda, noruana. Nti omwana na akula, mumubidi, ne mumagezi, Mukumanya abantu era nga kwatu adinekisa okuveri katonda no recho yesu yakuzibwa mukutegera katonda chokacho kachoka but even physically yakuzibwa 
nga mwana mukuru ategera ata manyi byonna yakula ne tata wo wo kunsi yusufu nga no kukola akola nga abajja nga ulira bakaddebe nga bamutwala musinzizo bible yogera bulungi kukuzibwa kwa yesu emyaka 12 yali muvubuka ina amagezi mu mutwe nga asobola kusoma bible nga no kuyitegera ategera bible bwega mati na imirira mu yekalu na asabe chawa ndikibwa na akisoma na amagezi nga imiride butengerera taiguliza tamaze gogera nenga ategera nga arabika bulungi abali mu bonane beunya omwana wa Yusuf ne Mariamu ababere Nazareth <coughs> no renso ngiyo mukama atubere tukuzaba ana bafe in stature in favor with god but also in everything that they need to know if you don't do that you are accountable when a child is brought to church for baptism for those of you who bring your children for baptism at church i wonder some of you are not even listening when we are teaching when we are reading whatever but when we come to church when you bring your child for baptism you have to have five people to stand with this child the father the mother and the three godparents and when they stand before the baptism font this is what we tell them <clears throat> that you have to make this child grow in the way the lord requires and so to make that happen you have to do three things one you have to pray for that child as the godparents and the parents you have to pray if you don't pray for this child then spiritually he is not nurtured so you have to be examples you have to be the examples when you come to church come with them when you are going to eat pray with them when they are going to sleep pray with them be an example what do you do they are watching you so be an example in your talk in your dressing in your everything be an example before you walk walk out of your bedroom ask yourself am i presentable before my children are they going to look at me as a father or just like the women they see on the streets you need to be an example and the three that you have to teach them if you have ever come for baptism we cannot miss out this is the what the first paragraph that we read and ask the first question are you ready to give this child the support that support by prayer by your example and by your teaching and you say i do i will i am willing but some of you just say because it's on paper but you have to give it to them aboluganda mukama eba zibwe tukuza abana ba katonda badinga ati betuleta abana okubatizibwa twina betubabuza ati omwana ono muna mulabiriranga abayima nabazadde nga mu musabira nga muli kya kulabira ko jebali nga mu muyigiriza muino okumusabira muino okubera ekyo kulabira ko muino okumuyigiriza you have to teach by prayer by example by teaching muino okumuyigiriza aho mwana takola bwati bobo ya balo pale yo mwana ne kukabera katoka miyake bili oteko kwa mbale mpale bobo gezo okweyamba okola bwati toilet manners bobo yogera na abantu okola bwati kino to chikola bwati oino okubayigiriza ngo muzadde so in parenting the process has to cover the entire life of a human being if you are a parent make sure you provide everything to your child but don't refer i be ali bigira yo kusomera when he goes to school this is when he will learn this when he goes here this is when he will get to know this when she gets married this is when she will have to learn this it will be too late you better do it today so that the girl the boy grows knowing what is required of him in proverbs chapter 22 verse 6 
which is a common verse. If you have never read this, then you have never gone to church and you don't have a Bible with you. But this is one of the common verses in the Bible. Proverbs chapter 22, verse 6. It says, Train a child in the way he or she should go, and when she or he is old, he will not depart from that way. Teach, train. Uh, NIV uses the word train. The Good News Bible uses the word teach. Teach the child the way he should go. And when he is old, he will not depart from it. Training. What does the word train mean? To do something repeatedly. You do it today, you do it in the evening, you do it tomorrow, you do it to, until you perfect it. For those of you who are singers, for those of you who are footballers, or any other game, you train. You train how to use your voice, you train how to use your legs, you train how to use your head, you train how to use your hands if you're a goalkeeper, you train, and you have to do it repeatedly in order to be perfect in that particular area. Many of us, if, if not all of us, are what we are because of what our parents put in us. It is wrong for me to say, this girl is stupid or this woman has done this. Actually, it's your mother who was because she failed to teach you the right way to go. It is your father who did not do it at the right time. So I have to blame you, not this particular child because he is what he is because of what was instilled in him when he or she was a baby. So train up a child the way he should go, and then when he grows, he will not depart from it. Engere sura yabi ni mwebidio nyoro wa mkaga. Timanyizo mwano mute kubo ili mguwani no kutambuli ramu. Tiaonebu alivanga mkade, talidifamu, manyiza, Okumanyiza chitegezo kudi ngane echi intu. No chikolo uruwarelo, no chikolo encha, no chikolo luli, okutu saru ofu kecho. Nyamanyati chono alichino, kubanga ya che manyiza, ochikozo umudiri nganoa. Bwekuba kusaba, umuana umanyizo okusaba, nebu wali kula, tagenda kuchiva amu. Waba kusuma bia wandi chibwa, umuana muigiri zecho, nebu wali kula, alima nyomuga sogu wacho. Norwecho, Mubiyo natu higiriza haba na bafe, okole chintu e chitufu, mkisele e chitufu, na haba antu haba tufu. We need to train our children to do the right thing at the right time, in the right place, with the right people. And once you, the child grows knowing that, and picking on a choice, getting a choice, says, this is what I have to do. He should know how to do what, when to do it, to do it with whom, and at what time? Eh? Muigiri ze, ngeri jasari doktambula, nabandu, mchifech tufu, nabandu waba tufu, mumbere tufu. This, if you do that, you allow the child to make choices. Parents, many times we make choices for our children, which is not very correct. Omwana wo, tomulonde la ocha kukola, Na imu igiri ze, amanye nchuo kukola. Kwa togenda kubela na yeki chona. Just teach your children to make the right choices. To know the wrong from the right. To know what is wrong, what is right. To know what is correct and what is not correct. The good from the bad. Omwana muigiri ze, chuo mugame ndi chino chibi, chino chirunji. Mwakole chirunji mugambi you are good girl. You are a bad girl. And when she grows up, knowing that this is bad, this is good. This is how a bad person behaves. This is how a good person behaves. He will always be proud of you telling her or him, you are a good girl. You are a good boy. When you say you are bad, he will feel that conviction and say, hey, once dad or mama said I'm bad, this is wrong to be done. And in so doing, he will learn to make the right choices for himself and for his entire life. Train them. I believe if I was to ask what are the challenges that we have before us in our families as far as 
parenting is concerned, I believe you have many. But allow me to say three or four. Ebi tu so moza. Kubo mtuwe guafi kugamba. Nti. Okulira habana. Mumbela yobula mumuli okuso moze buwa. Biso mozo chibi tu itamu enaku zino. Tekisoka. Good day. Time. Good day. Parents do not have time for their children. Parents do not have time with their children. Tetui na wude na baana bafe. Ngojeke bia COVID-19 nikati. Na yeje tufude tetui na wude na baana bafe. Luwachi tetui na wude ensonga muzimanyi. No luwachi tetui kuigiriza mwana. Ngatoli uo. You cannot train in the absence. You can't in absence. Yeah, you can't. Omwana okumuyi gilizo ina kuba how to train. Olabecha akoze chinunjo omweba ze. Olabecha atakoze bulunjo omunenye. No rech, you need to be there. If it is to teach, you have to be there physically. We wawe nda kusinu sobulo kuba sobeseza. We can even train them on phone or whatever, online. Yes, but it's better. Why did God put children in our families? So that we can interact with them physically. Teach them when we see them, when they see us, when we are their examples. So, time is a challenge. If you don't have time, if you are busy working, if you don't, if the children are at school all the time, it's very unfortunate. One time I visited one school in Bukoto, it's a boarding school, and this was a holiday. I didn't expect to find children at school. My goodness, I met some six children there. And I asked the matron and the teacher, what are these children doing here? They told me the parents chose to leave these children at school because they are more comfortable here than at home. Possibly, they belong to other women who are not the women within the home. So the father would feel comfortable paying more money to the school to take care of the child. For the three months during the term, the child is at school. During the holiday, the child is at school. You have no time. You have buried the future of this child. No parents to mentor our children. Abazade tebali wo kurabi didabana ba we. Nga number one when you get that they don't have time. Abana bakula na ba ntu balala. Bakula na ba maid sawaka. Maid ya manyo mwana walia. Ya manyo mwana wasiba. Ya manyo lugue iluwa yambala. Ya manyabuli chikuata kumwana wo. Guo koma obu komi. No labi didaka katono sanga no kubongo tabongo tanga yeba ka. Nga weba za maid yo kulabi didi omwana wo. Toma nyibi alide, toma nyibi wabade. Maid. Ba wardens. Beba labi didi abana bafi. Ba matrons. Beba yiba labi didi abana bafi. Aba wala. Omwana naweze miaka kuminebili. Nga tama ina cha kukola. Wali wo omwana omu ba zade beba musibida. Embele ngenga agena mchisulo. Yali mupi five. Nima musibida embele nge nebi lala nebi lala nebi okulia. Na habi tuwala kusomero. Na hatu kawali metuwa ni naya chino, 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 ch Na agende wa metro na mubuza bibampa debi nubiyachi. Umwana amiaka kumi nebili, tauli danga kopadis, <coughs> zi amba chi. Ni mama jarieka, tata jarieka, na hava laba ganda bejevali hava kuru, neba senga hava jevali. Ni umwana tabuli danga ko, life changes. Niti umukutu kwa miaka jino, chino chiba au. Buono laba chino, toti ya chitegeza chino. Tetu ina vana, tetu ina bo. Kakati, ba metro ni bebawe chokola. Mikuwa anuja wabu kusomele, bebawa igirize chokola. 
omwana nakula nga si mwana wo ne mwana wa balala i'm saying we have left our children to maids we have left our children to matrons at school we have left our children to other people to mentor them to take care of them to teach them how life changes that when it comes to this age from this time up to this time you will see this happening when it happens this is what it means when you do this then you are in danger this is what you have to do when you teach your children they will keep coming to you for answers daddy mommy i have this challenge what do i do daddy mommy i had so and so say this is it practical daddy is this correct to be done mommy how what do i do this with this they have energy. children we don't have time for them so they ask from peers they get answers from other people and they just grow up like that kindly have your children with you thirdly the modern technology and media i'm not going to talk more about this but you know it what it has happened we are giving it a full sunday someone is going to talk to us about media and technology uh, our children the films they watch what do they attend to they know how to use the phones better than us the parents they know it well for me when i have a challenge at home i have a, my grandchild who is in p6 p7 they tell me no if you want to do this you do this you click here you get this far 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 informed than myself and in so doing sometimes they watch things which we cannot even know you just ask you judge jump up for continue yo nza nyaka za nyu you give the phone to him na tula ya today tomanyi bya alaba tomanyi bya akola chi i'm not saying be an askari or do not give them these gadgets no what i'm saying teach them what is bad what is good what is should be watched what should not be watched let them make choices no recho technology and media ngabwe ngambye ne tv na kuzina abana babera waka obude bona bali ku tv bako wabe basoma ne bateka ko other programs toliwo no recho balabachi kubo muntu chala bachabera no bobera ku muntu omukuru chola bachobere chikubera mu bwongo choroza ndi chino kolebwa the other challenge is poverty poverty we have gone crying poverty and because we are poor we have left our children even to go to look for money as you drive in jam you see boys others are carrying bananas these are carrying boiled eggs these are carrying uh, avocados these are selling whatever children children even in primary children they are on the street they are selling this because they bring you the money that is the the poorest kind of stage that we are on it is not the children who are poor and not you who are not you are not the one who is poor but your head is poor you cannot be creative to the davana bafe ni tubaleka ni bagenda nga bakola bi bakola tubaguli de bogoya ni bagenda batunda tubano get de vacado ni bagenda batunda mu jamu ku rugudo ba ni bale to obusente be bale sene tusanyuka ne abana abo bazika bichi be bayigeyo bichi be balaba bogera chi ani ayogera nabo ani abakwata ko ani abagamba chino kubanga tukabo obwavu twine echo kolero obwavu katonda nga atubera ndoza chemba nsokerako kicho osobola kolero obwa mchifo cho mwana okumuwa agenda atunde amevu nebirala ku rugudo muwe bintu ebisinga obwangu eke wage kati nda byenkole ebisinga obwangu nina abana nabazukuru bali aba naye ngina ne ngule chisawo cha 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 manda aga ebiva mu manda bibai webyo ebisiriza nende te chisawo kunusu en 13 oben 15 ekisawo echo kiva mu bafu 15 buli bafu esobola kola manda nkaga buli manda ana gagula silingisi lukumi amande nkaga gagula omutwalo gumu ne kitundu ensawo emwe eva mu bafu 15 nga buli bafu jitunze omutwalo gumu ne kitundu ofune emitwalo abiri mu ebiri mu 
Echintu choso wolo kola mangu awaka. Omwana aliwaka. Oyogera na ye. Na afao na akola vile. Na ye oso wolo kumula bachakola. Na uchikola na ye. E, Oinzo kudire mfufuntono. No gata mu. Bisiri zomu. Oinzo kugula yobu unga wa muogo. No gata mu. Oinzo kudire vi kutabiyaru monde. Nebya matoke. No bikaza. Gomara no biocha. E very vamu. No gata mu bisiri za. Nebi kola chako muitilifu. Ne mufumbi sawaka, ne mutunde ebweru, mitwara abiri mu ebiri mu enku mitano mu kisawo kimu. Awe wange bibakola. Bayira bibakola ne bira ne bidala. Okuli mu obutiko na batera okuli mu obutiko. Katunu nyao. Ne kuba kuba twale bayira ke bakola. Atu obutiko we bali yako. Eh? Kugamba bwe bwe katu bayina bye bakola. Do something. Ba we nkoko makumi ya abiri. Chako dust. I was calculating. You just buy one chako sack, uh, the dust, at 5,000 shillings. And out of that, you get 15 basins out of that. Because for my use, basins. And out of the, 50, the, the one basin, you get 60, those, those bricks, the bricks. 60. And you sell four at 1,000. You can even sell five. You can even sell six to get the best market. And so out of 60, you will get 15,000 shillings. 15 times 15 basins is, is 225,000. And this is in a mere week. They are already dried, and you can sell them. Far, far better than going to the street. I feel bad whenever I meet these children at church. It is really bad. We need to pray that the Lord protects us. And we put that in our mind. Uh, that's about poverty. About media, we will have time for it. But we pray, make the right, teach your children to make the right choices. Tell them what is bad and what is good. About uh, uh, those who are supporting our children, this is important. Let's love our maids in the homes. Let's have love for our maids. For those of you who do not love your mates, who take care of your children, I'm telling you, you have a big, big problem. I've been to Luzira prison for four years. Some of you know, and I know how many maids are in women's prison. Why? Because of mistreating children. But those are a very small fraction of those who mistreat children. What they eat, what they love them. They are the life of your children. They know what they give them. They know what to do. Kindly be there. Provide for them. Love your mates. Provide for what they should dress. Buy them the vaselines and so on. If you are giving them 100,000, let it be for them. They entirely provide everything to this child. Don't say because I pay him or her, so he will use that money. No. Let that 100,000 be for just for her to send at her parents. Provide as if she is your daughter. And once you love her and she gets to know that you love her that much, she will love your child. Nete tuwa gadeba kwezi bafede, tuwa gala, tuwa boneleza, tuwa ganyo kuria chino, tuwa gamba banyo chayo mkaru ngavana wafibanyo mata, tuwa suza wansi kukade ya ngavana, basula kumifaliso, ajia kubonya wunyo mwana wane mena kufamu. Amata gono mulekele ya jo ganywa, umwana muovu ujobu. Kalu nebifana uwebiti. Na uwecho muagara wa kozi wa mwe, buo muleta mfule muana wa wakatu. Mubalida sente zomu wa. Sente zomu wa zimuwe, azikoze sovazi uweleza wabu. Ne muovu lichayetaga. Oba bizigo, oba sabuni, oba ngoeza kuambara, oba angato. Tula na imu moto kamulete mkanisa angazuse kusawa na ye. Umwana ulirenga aliwa mama wa atata. So si mukozi. Abali abaza waka, toya anjula antibano mwana, nori mwana ono mkozi. Aa, balobo na baana baange, ono ye jen, oli ye gundi, oli ye gundi. Baana baange, omwana jia kuhuli langa is part of you. Buwabe langa uoli nga katipotuli mu COVID-19. Omwana mureka gende yeba keko fumbe, ofumbira baana bo, ofumbira omuami wo. Na yo ya gala weba ko, ya gala okolechi no, ya gala okende jindi. Omwana abela unga bulinuna kune buwabe la wo, atawana. Omwana oyo. Neba azara mzali nga wabu. Jukira. Jabana buwebisika buwa mkama. 
katonda jakulo no mwana oyo katonda amuwo mukisa agende jagenze afumbirwa afuno bufumbo bulunji gwe obere woli abana obafuke nga basomye nnyo bagenze masomera amalunji nenga tibayina che bajeyo kubanga wabonerezo omulala no isawo uwo olona afuna mu ekibonerezo nga tumaze okutegera ti abana batwetaga tufuno obudde bwabana tetu ina budde naye no nyo budde bwabana no nyo budde find the time for your children find the time make time create time for your children obo fulu my if you driving out drive with them joke with them play with them talk to them ask them questions tell them stories this is the right time that we have as covid 19 uh, condition please make better use of it abana bamanye ntitubera ne tata tubera ne mama tunyumya tuogera naye this is a very very profitable and beneficial time for all of us so have time for your children create time for your children love them teach them love one another as husband and wife when the children are watching and once they do that then they will also love both of you they will love each other they will do exactly that when they also grow up parenting amid his life challenges take it serious just to say god i thank you for giving me this gift how should i take care of him or her god will provide and do the needful when you are choosing schools for them please take them to schools where they will learn even spiritual matters where you think there is some spirituality in that school now where we just take children to the best performing school academically yeah they will do fantastically they will go to best schools but out of which you will lose no let you take them to schools which will also instill in them spiritual life and that will be good for each one of us parenting amid its life challenges okulera abana mukusomoze wakwe tuitamu tetu chadda mabega atugenda bumaso tetu chadda miyaka ja feja 5 na yeka tonda atubere professor ambiti yawani kanagaamba tibo bato yagala nchuka chuka nchuka chuke ja kuchusa professor ambiti said in his book traditional religions and philosophy that if you don't want to change change will change you so do not be changed by ch by change but you need to change yourself and then the situation will change i would like to wish you well and prayer my prayer with you is that we continue to look at our families first consider your family number one not your workplace some of us say if i don't work what will i feed my family with but remember you came from a family and you got a job so your family is number one and then work secondary so kawaka na bili langa wa nobo no kola sente zifana na zitia ngatoli musanyufu na bana bo na mchala wa waka obana omwami wo na bana bo za kumala bisera toja kusanyuka toja kusula ngo kaba ne bila byo joksisinkana na era banga waka walunji abana bakwagala bamanye echo kola mchala wo nayo muli basanyufu ebibasoba ko mu bilongosa kubanga ebizibu tebigana kujja challenges will always be there but how do you handle is the question i thank you for listening and wish you a nice week today is the first day of july i wish you july and i congratulate you upon the completion of june the challenges have been there but god is there for us and with us in the name of god the father the son and the holy spirit amen lord god our heavenly father we thank you for being a good god a god who saw it fit that we should be born in a family grow in a family be nurtured in a family and continue to be a children lord we thank you for being that we pray that you continually take us on teach us guide us make us mentors of these gifts that you give us lord we have learned that the children are gifts from you 
we are just there to take care of them. Make us the people, the right people for them, for them to make the right choices for their lives. We thank you, we glorify you through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. And may the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be with each one of you. Whatever you lay your hands on to do, be with your families as you nurture God's children and remain with you now and forevermore. Amen. Praise the Lord.